Hello there. Cosmos is Cass here, bringing a dance break to you. And I'm going to try to project a little bit more because I feel like for some reason these videos uh, come through with me sounding like, like you can't hear me, basically. Um, so I'm going to do my best to just be like, woo, I am here with my voice. And that's maybe what I'm going to be doing with the dance as well. And I invite you to experiment with that. So um, how can we push ourselves to, uh, you know, attract that greater energy that we really want, that we want to feel really like, you know, joyful, lively, just like really excited to be here. And just like, mm-hmm, we're doing this, soaring up, filling with light, sharing that light with others, share it with me. <laughs> so, yes, um, I've also kind of been today before I hopped on here just feeling like, ooh, you know, there is juice to be had in the stillness. And equally so in activation, in taking action. So, you know, that play between stillness and action. And uh, really what it comes down to, I think, is how much we are bringing a sense of really intention to wherever we are in the moment, whether it is a still moment you know, we're, we're still on the inside. Um, you know, we could be active on the outside, but have a still quality on the inside. And just the same, we can be really, uh, we can be really still on the outside, but have a lot going on on the inside. And whether that works for us or not, whether it feels like good, I think comes down to just like how much um, we're loving ourselves up, we're like loving the process, whether it's a still process or more of an active process. So, um, today I just want to do a dance where, you know, I'm playing with the still, playing with the active, and it's in that, you know, lit up joyful kind of way. So here we go with a song from Yaima, quickly becoming one of my favorites lately, to get it right. Dust moves again.
All right, cool. So I feel like talking louder than is my natural tone almost feels like yelling or feels like an over exuberance. <laughs> but that's, I don't know. I don't know how to talk so I could clearly be heard. So experimenting and yeah, just, it does help me, like, just the fact, simple fact that I'm projecting more, like, makes me feel like a little bit more sympathetic arousal, a little bit more ready to take on the world, and, um, voice aside, yeah, I don't know, it's always a joyful play, um, whenever we can embrace the moment fully and say yes, whether it's stillness or action or playing back and forth between the two. So yeah, um, do it with me and see what you find. All right. See you next time. Uh, next time should be a live dance break. So if you're paying attention to this one, then um, I believe I'm gonna make it happen Monday night. I think it's gonna be the best time for me. Um, probably about six o'clock Alaska time, seven o'clock Pacific. And we'll see. I'm actually planning on a, a live dance break as well as offering some free coaching. So be sure to check it out.